Okay, hi Libra. This is uh, your 2020 April reading. I'm going to go ahead and find any messages for you. Today is April 9th, so if there's any messages that want to come through to Libra right now, um, any guidance, any advice, or anything in general, any general messages for, for Libra. From here to perhaps January, April 14th, April 20th. Okay. Capricorn energy slash cards are flying. Okay, Libra. Some situation with someone or I'm sensing so far. Additional messages for Libra, please to help clarify these cards. Hmm. Okay. Are you able to see all your cards? Yes. Okay. Libra. Additional messages to help clarify these cards, please, Spirit. Okay, so here we go. We have... <laughs> okay. <laughs> Damn. Oh my god, Libra. Okay, so we have the devil card. We have this uh, two of cups in reverse. And we have this entrapment card in reverse right under this four of wands. like Which is a, a usually a happy card. And then, okay. So Libra, you could be dealing right now with a situation regarding another person. So if this is already, you know, sounding similar or familiar... This could be, one, a relationship, two, perhaps a toxic situationship that isn't maybe a relationship, but maybe there's some lust involved here or some sexual energy um, more than anything, like more than love or more than friendship. I feel like there is more, like the general card here is justice in reverse and the devil. So I feel like here we have this Capricorn card and this Libra card. This is you. So I feel like if this is you in reverse, um, you could be being, you could be thrown off right now by a Capricorn or by another person who is perhaps very, you know, if this person is a friends with benefits perhaps or just a. Um, or even a relationship, you know, your your significant other. I feel like this relationship has already become very either toxic um, and very perhaps, and it and it this has blurred you. I feel like your vision, it has blurred your concept of of fairness, because this is in reverse. So it's thrown you off balance. Okay, Libra. So this person can be perhaps a bad influence or could have perhaps some some addictions going on um it could be literal addictions or actual just you know like sexual addictions um with you and i feel like this specifically isn't something healthy and i feel like you you don't exactly are you're not you're in denial perhaps <clears throat> or if you do know it, I don't feel like you want to act on it. You don't want to enforce this justice on them. Here we have this two of cups in reverse right next to this card. And and we have this six of cups here. So this person could be just so like... This person may have been in your life for a while. And that's why it's really hard to let go of them. <clears throat> like I feel like... For you, this this could be a situation with someone that you're just comfortable with them. And although they're toxic, or, or although they're getting tendencies that aren't healthy, or although they're doing this and that, um, you could be possibly um, attached to them because of the connection that you guys have had like for a long time already. And this is low-key looking like it's not going so well. So I feel like although you are conscious of this even if you were conscious of this i feel like you're not willing to act like again i said like you're not willing to act upon it because you are comfortable or because you don't want to ruin something that you invested so much time in 
I feel like at this point, you are realizing that even the lust isn't even as fulfilling anymore. Like, I feel like maybe after, you know, like, like, I feel like the lust is just not enough. And I feel like you, you're putting up your walls around it or you're trying to pretend that it doesn't bother you. Um, you could be in denial right now. You could be in a situation where you're really kind of being trapped by this person and you don't even realize it. Um, I feel like you're staying entertaining something. And if this isn't about another person, by the way, I mean, it could be a friendship or just some situation that is just toxic right now. It could be a parent or something, a sibling even. But I feel like, no, for you, like, I sense a lot of other person energy, so this could be a significant other. But, you know, even with the only factors that perhaps you were interested in, I feel like even those aren't even fulfilling enough anymore. Like, you know, maybe you feel weird afterwards or, or it ends up always just ending bad again. Um, so it just, it doesn't seem, it doesn't seem like it's working anymore. And maybe you had hopes with this person. You had hopes, maybe, you know, like I said, you'd known each other for a long time. So you had hopes that maybe this person was the person you were going to end up with, you know, marriage or, or a commitment of some sort. So I feel like there is so, you're ignoring these barriers on yourself because you still have hope for this. Um, but the reality is, because this is tied to this, uh, this Eight of Swords in reverse, I feel like you are realizing that this is not, like this, this isn't a realistic option anymore. Um, this, this Eight of Swords <clears throat> is kind of a, it's in reverse, so I feel like you're you're slowly waking up from it. At least you're kind of um, this idea that there could be commitment or something. Like I feel like you're walking away from it now. Um, like you're realizing that this isn't even fulfilling enough in other aspects. So why would you want to aspire for something that even isn't fulfilling for you? So definitely listen to your intuition, Libra. If you feel already that this isn't even like gonna end up into anything bigger um and you feel unsafe or you feel trapped listen to that intuition make sure that you're able to walk away um and hopefully like you know if this is an abusive situation by the way i'm not sure if it is but for some of you if it is make sure that you're very careful and that you rely on support from others oh shit um perhaps um get advice from your friends or or contact people that can help you okay libra so let me know i mean not let me know <laughs> i was about to finish this but i forgot you need oracle cards so um i'm gonna go ahead and pick from this love deck and then a healing oracle okay um so any messages additional messages for libra Addition, okay. Let's see if any of these cards. So opportunity beckons and trust. So here, this is a card that's already signaling that you're no no longer finding interest in something that maybe once was like your everything. Like I said, this person could have meant the world to you, but even now, like you're just like not interested anymore, or it's just not fulfilling enough. You're bored, perhaps. Or, or you just don't feel safe. You just don't feel like this is um, enough or isn't, you know, at your standards anymore. But here we have this trust card. So I feel like you're, you're, you're starting to take that leap of faith to jump outside of this uh, entrapment. I feel like you're coming to your senses. You're, you're realizing this very slowly, but it's an intuitive message coming to you. Okay, Libra. And I really do hope you listen to this. You know, opportunity beckons. If you have an opportunity to leave or to express your emotions safely with this person that, you know what, this isn't enough. Like, this isn't working for me. Then you should definitely consider, like, walking away if this isn't something that you want anymore. Is there an additional message here for Libra? Additional message here for Libra in regards to these cards. Abundance. 
Okay. So I feel like a lot of a like either a but like like abundance in the sense of money or also in the sense of um what you call it happiness is in, is on the way okay libra so i don't i guess like something that came up really quickly could be like this person maybe is used to gambling i don't know it just came up but i feel like leaving the situation you will find a lot of abundance in yourself again whether it's happiness, whether it's you don't have to like waste more resources on this person so you get to waste it on yourself. I feel like this is what this card is for you. This abundance all of a sudden will be reinvested into yourself and into your own important, like what you feel is important. It could be your family, your friends, but just not this person anymore. So I hope that you figure out what, what it is and you figure out this situation, Libra. Make sure you do it safely. And, you know, if it resonated, this resonated, please let me know, okay? Um, good luck with everything, Libra.